Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Daily Duel. So, we're using Mermels. Yes, Mermels, the deck that never freaking dies. This deck has been on Daily Duel since episode one, still on here. Still got that shitty hand that you guys know that you all love, that you come here for, that shitty ass hand. So, yes, Mermels. <laughs> So, uh, like good old fashioned, I will be telling you about my previous day. I don't want this video to be too long because I'm kind of tired. I want to go to bed. So, I'm going to go ahead and uh, talk about this one quickly. Hopefully, not get too distracted by the duel. Especially with this shitty hand. There's not much I have to do with this shitty hand. I talk about how Mermel's done die and they're still good. And I get this shitty ass hand. What the fuck is that? I have never seen this guy before. I, I don't know what this deck is. I, I, don't, I, don't, I don't know what this deck is. I just know that he just ripped off like half my damn life points in that one damn play. Oh, okay, so apparently they summon to the field. Then if it's this card, you also return to the hand. Okay. So you, you just you just jump out the bushes, stab me for like half my damn life points, and then just run away? Like, really? Like that, though? I'm gonna have to do this play. I'm literally gonna have to do this fucking play. I don't want to do this fucking play, but I'm literally gonna have to do this fucking play. Like, you don't even fucking understand. So go ahead and give me that fucking abyss here. You pump nothing. Yeah, I'm gonna have to do this fucking play. Uh, hello? Give me too bad. I didn't really get opportunity to read any of them cards. And of course, they're not in the damn log. Like, hello? Like, I, I have no I, I've never seen that deck before, so for me to actually play against it right now, it's kind of just, mm. Yes, I would like to summon without tributes. Hello? Uh, I don't know who to go for. I guess I'll go for Gaios. Since Gaios is good. Like I said, yeah, Draco Sack, I'm not sure. I think I heard something about bouncing my shit, so if I go for Draco Sack, it looked like he could easily bounce my shit, so not into that. Not into that. I've never seen this deck before, so to go against it, if I don't know enough about it, I, I feel dumbfounded. G well, fucking Radecki, of course. I knew this shit was gonna happen. I knew this shit was gonna happen. I was like, this fucking number generator is gonna give them all the cards that I won. I knew it. Fucking knew it. It's fine. I got the Dark Hole, you got the Regeki. It's cool. I didn't even update this deck yet. I haven't even updated it. You control another one. You can target one face up. You return it to the hand. That's what I thought. So you can return my shit to the hand. So I fucking thought. What the fuck? Okay, that's weird. I guess he's like, yeah, hey, I got this though. I guess I can just go ahead and be you. Right, I got this. Or maybe he really did lose kind of I have no idea. Alright, let's go ahead and get another duel in. We're back. Alright, let's get another duel in. So, I quickly just updated the damn deck, like, real quick. So, I put in the Soul Tries, put in the Regeki, so. Yeah, hopefully we'll be seeing some of that. Won't be surprised, you know, it's some damn number generator, so. Don't be surprised if you see one of them. I already got the fucking title, which is that one, so. Number generating, go. Anyway, let me get started talking. So, of course, it's Wednesday. Let me talk about my Tuesday. So, Tuesdays, I have Women's Studies and I have Calculus. So, uh, you know, Women's Studies, the girl who I was supposedly talking to, approachable girl. Remember her? Remember her? The girl who I was trying to have a plan to talk to her, but I never really got an opportunity to? Yeah. Let me, let me, let me break it down for you. And uh, you guys know my moral. My moral. What's, what's the moral of the story? Bitches be crazy? Yeah. All right. So, I show up to class. She's standing there, I, you know, I walk up to her, you know, and I'm kind of, you know, give her this little wave, like, hey. And she looks at me, and then immediately looks away, I'm like, so you're not even going to acknowledge my existence. Is that how it is? So I don't even exist to you. Is that, I, I, is that how it is? I did not know it was like that, though. Like that, though? Like that, though. Wow. No tuning with the tuning. That fucking sucks. That fucking sucks. You know, like that though, like that though. That, I, I, you know, I don't get. I don't. I don't understand. I just don't understand. We were talking. We were getting along great. You know, I was getting to know you. We were, everything was chill. Everything was fine. Now you don't even want nothing to do with me. You don't even want to speak to me. Like, wh why? 
bitch, bitches be crazy. I swear to God. Moral of the stuff. Fucking story. That's always the moral of the story. Bitches be crazy. I don't understand. She literally walked with me to my class. If you wanted nothing to do with me, then you should have just ignored me or said go away in the first place. I did nothing to this girl. Nothing. It, that, I talked to her. I gave her my number. She never called or texted me. And now she wants nothing to do with me as if I don't even exist. Like, where where did I go wrong? Where I, I don't understand. I, I'm lost. I, I can't eat them. I can't eat them. Stupid. Swear to God. Bitches be crazy. There's no reason for you to be crazy, but you are. Just... <sighs> bitches be crazy. That's all I gotta say about that. As you can clearly tell by the title, this has nothing to do with fucking approach. Was everybody losing connection against me? Like, hello? Like, my connection is fine. My, my modem, my router, they're all good. Laptop, internet connection good. I'm good. What the hell's going on? <sighs> They're back. Alright, let's get another duel in. Hopefully not disconnect this time. What's that? I don't, I don't care. Nega. What's that? I don't, I really don't care. This deck can go first or second, so it's fine. One. This one? That was really anticlimactic. You know, aren't you the face up one? Yeah, you're the fucking face up one. I'm just gonna set two scare shit on my opponent, even though they're fucking nothing. They're just real decrees. And right now, there's really no point in me committing to the play right now. I'll allow you to do something before I, and I'll respond to your play. So, like I said, clearly the name of this title of this video has nothing to do with fucking approachable girl. But I guess apparently she's not approachable girl. She's fucking wants nothing to fucking do with you. You can go die. I'm I'm above you. I'm too good to talk to you, fucking bitch girl. I swear, I hate, I hate. I swear to God, why? Fucking bitches be crazy for no reason. Going against infirmities, uh, cause he's trying to keep the dream alive. <laughs> of course you quit. Of course you quit. Some that fucking road of queen. Like, I, 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 I'm using infirmities. I can't. I'm not. I cannot do it. I'm back row. I, I used to be XC's and aggressive, but they put my card down to one, so now I'm trash. Anyway, let's go get another, 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 another duel. We're right back. Let's try this again. Ah. Uh. Okay, you can go first, I can go first. You wanna go first? Go first, I don't care. Ugh, his hand's bad. I need a discard her. What's up with me getting infantry? I literally opened up with infantry like the last couple of duels. Like, hello? What's up with that? Soul charge. I um, don't need you right now. Definitely not, so. Uh. Anyway, women's studies was women's studies. We're now talking about race, so you know, like I said, it has nothing really it has nothing to do with women's studies. You might as well call, call it just identity discrimination studies. That's what you should call it, damn class. That's all it is. You know, discrimination of class, race, gender, sex, sexual orientation, everything. Just uh, discrimination. <laughs> how you, how do you feel discriminated? Is this also another infinity? This better not be another Infernity, but I can't, I can't think of any other deck that plays Stygian and Super Troll besides Infernity. It'd be super nice if I could fucking get a monster. I guess. Yeah, I guess that works. Oh, yeah, that really, that, that really works. What the fuck am I talking about? That really fucking works. Rector scale. Okay. No. Hello, that fucking really works. Really works. That shit was my saving grace right there. Alright, so I get the effect of the one discarded, but I don't get the one that is effect that's sensor graveyard. Right, got it. Soul charge. Fucking saving grace right there. Can't attack you? That's cool. I'll take that. 
Uh, should I go for Gyos or should I go for Draco Sack? I'll go for Draco Sack. Cause last time I got fucking Regeki, that shit sucked. <laughs> Hello. So, yeah, women's studies is women's studies. Nothing much. Uh, actually talked with uh, Kirby girl. <laughs> Uh, we were just walking down the hallway talking together, talking about the new Smash, because she's excited for it, of course. Then, literally, <laughs> I walk I walk with her to about the D-Building. And I whip out my cell phone, and I start checking my emails, right? And I'm just like, oh, go ahead and go to class. And she literally just stands there waiting for me, like, Bitch, why are you standing here waiting for me? Like, go to class. Like, <laughs> like you don't need me to walk into class. You have a boyfriend. Once again, you have a boyfriend. I'm... Not really interested. Not, no, like, I'm not gonna step on his toes, I'm not gonna step on anybody's toes, go, 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 no. <laughs> yeah, so, it's kind of, I, I didn't mean to be a dick, but I, it's, it's kind of ticking me off that she, you know, she, she wants to be so friendly, buddy-buddy with me when I'm, I don't need more friends. So. You see, you, you like how I use my, my limited to one title to do my fucking, uh, my play of fucking that. Touch some back row, summon necromancer, da, 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 da. Stygian, special summon, what? A necromancer in your hand? Yeah, okay. Swear to God. You know when I flip up this goddamn royal decree during your end phase, you're gonna quit, so... I don't even know why I'm gonna... Yeah. This place seemed really anticlimactic. Like I said, as soon as I flip up this royal decree, it's gonna be GG anyway. So, sure, I'll allow you to search for your freaking thing and everything. I'll, do, I'll, allow, I'll allow you to go the whole nine yards. Now I flip up this royal decree and you just go quit. I'm like, yep. I said you're not the only one who's trying it out. Okay, now what? Oh, Instafusion. What's to say? Now what? Like, oh, Instafusion. Just seeing if it's playable. I need my infernities. I don't want that deck to die. I need it. Mm-hmm. Still gotta watch this deck play with itself. I said the struggle is real with only one Archfiend, but I guess you can go ahead and try. Ah, uh, anyway. Forget about that. Let's go ahead and, uh, move on. So, of course, play that. No, that's fine. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know, especially with this Royal Decree face down, your plays just seem kind of anticlimactic, but you might have something up your sleeve, I don't know. Alright, so there's another Necromancer, there's an Archfiend, Archfiend will of course search again, and what are these two gonna do? Make like a... Levier, I guess? Levier, Detach, Summon back to Stygian, XC with these two, like... I, I don't know, I don't know where we're going with this. No, okay, so it is a synchro variant. Okay, yeah, I saw that coming. Alright, so that's gonna summon back Stygian. Uh huh. Fucking marathon ass turn, still. You couldn't let the deck just lie down. You couldn't let sleeping dogs lie. You had to fucking just be annoying with it. So. Make those into Castell or something? Right? Make these two into Castell, detach, bounce this, use that effect, summon that, yeah. That can read your plays like a fucking book! This is boring. in here watching you play with yourself. Just... Oh, Infernity still! Uh-huh. 
Aha. This is boring. Let me top that Regeki. I have Rege Regeki and Dark Hole in here, so let me top deck one of them too. That'd be nice. That'd be super nice. Just roll a creature in the end phase, draw that Dark Hole, that Regeki. He'd be so damn salty. That'd be the best. That's the reason why I never play Inferno. You don't got the luck to play that fucking deck. Love how he like top decked into that fucking foolish and foolish through the perfect shit. Go ahead and tap that. Nope, another salvage. I only run two. Fucking drew it into it. Fucking salvage, really? Ah, fucking salvage. Like, why? That's the second time the shit's happened. Well, I only run two because it clogs. Draw two. It's happened in the fucking first duel too. Like, hello? Like, thanks. Thank you, fucking just deck. Thank you. Thank you for that. Can't even play the fucking salvage either. Thank you. Thank you. I could fucking, I could literally summon title and fucking, but why? You know? Why? He got me beat. Because I fucking drew another fucking salvage. And I can't play them. I run at two so they don't fucking clog. They clog. At two. Top decks are foolish for the perfect Inferno the Arch Fiend play. I draw salvage. You got it. It's cool. I'm gonna finish this fucking story. I'm gonna be done. Cause fuck this. Fuck number generators. I swear. They always wanna fucking fuck me in the ass. I don't know why. But this guy's probably like, oh yeah, look at Freddy's are still alive. Like, no, you just got fucking lucky as fuck. All right, you got lucky as fuck. So enjoy it. Keep on thinking that our infernities are still alive. They ain't. They ain't. They fucking ain't. You're just like fucking. You're. You know what? You just like fucking. Uh, you just like fucking insectors now. Where if you get your play and you do really well, you 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 might have something. But you you someone immediately just stops and hits your key play with a nice rhapsody and berserk and oh my god. <laughs> uh, uh. Whatever. All right. Let me finish. So, yeah. This game kind of ticked off at her. I mean, I don't want to yell at her, but you know, I just don't want to be all buddy wetty. I don't, I don't need any more friends. I want a girlfriend, and, and I don't want to step on your boyfriend's toes. You know, you know. All of a sudden, unless you come up to me and tell me that you broke up with your boyfriend and you want my dick, not interested. So, <laughs> now, I don't mind talking to you about smash, talking with you about smash and stuff, but really, don't, don't. <laughs> anyway, calculus class. Uh, we had a take-home test. Uh, oh, I also got my calculus test back. I got 150, 159 out of 150, so it's like that 106%, I think. Something around there. So, I did pretty well in the calculus test. Pretty proud of that. Um, uh, la, 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 la. So, calculus class had a take-home test. I, of course, worked on it. I actually finished it and completed it and went over the answers with uh, other classmates, and they uh, also did fine as well. You got, you know, good same answers. Um, and of course, as you can tell by the title of this video, I'm going to be talking about Calculus Girl. So, I, as you guys know, Calculus Girl is my favorite right now. There's not much, actually, it's not, there's nothing else to work with, really. What? There's Movie Girl, who is a bitch, and then there was a Poetry Girl, who is also a bitch, and then there's, there's a Kirby Girl, who has a boyfriend, and then there's a Amish Girl, who sometimes acts like a child, but then sometimes doesn't, not sure how I feel about her. And then there's Calculus Girl, who is all woman. All woman, I. Mm 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 mm. All woman. <laughs> all right, like I said, she's literally like the only girl who I was friends with who actually had some boobles. Now she has, she has like, L E C cups. I, 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 mm. And they and they, and they match her her nice little body frame. It's really like she's like she's short short. She's like five feet tall with C cups. Like what the heck? Like like all the nutrients just went straight to your boobs. You didn't get any taller, huh? Well, freaking Amish girl on the other hand, she's like, depending on what shoe she wears, she, shoe she's wearing, she's taller than me. So, anyway, uh, so, 
usually, like I said, when it comes to Calculus Girl, she's actually sitting a seat, you know, next to me, but in front of me. But for some odd reason, the rows were pushed back, so... And the guy who uses his next to me showed up like an hour late for class and hit them. So she literally sat next to me. And I was like, yes, there is a guide. <laughs> so I got to sit next to her all class. It was awesome. And she looks a lot t I actually told her that she looks a lot taller sitting down than she does standing up. She's like, I get that a lot. I'm like, yeah. She's like, she's like, so you haven't noticed that my feet swing and that my feet don't touch the ground when we're sitting at the desk? I was like, no, I actually never. I, now now, now I, I need to look out for that because that it seems so cute. Like, we're sitting at our desk and your feet don't touch the ground? Like, I, I was, like it's not even that far from the ground. But, yeah, you know, her upper body is much longer than her, her lower body, her legs. You know, usually you see a, 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 you know, a average height person, their legs are definitely longer than their torso and their neck and their head. But, Hers is about, I'd say about the same, but to say if you just cut her in half and just set to her the next job, I'd say she's about the same, so she's pretty short. Like I said, about five feet tall. And, you know, I'm not that tall myself, so, I, you know, I, I, I'm I totally like that. And like I said, I like short girls, so I can totally go with that. It makes me feel tall and manly. Yes. <laughs> anyway, so, uh, we do the usual calculus thing. We're now working on, like, areas and, you know, rotating around the axis, 3D shapes, blah, 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 blah. Calculus, yay. Graphs. Fuck graphs. <laughs> That's literally all I said, all class, because we work on graphs. All class, I was just like, fuck graphs. Fuck graphs. Fuck graphs. Fuck graphing paper. Fuck graphing calculators. Fuck graphs. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. So I can just stay stupid. Uh, so, uh, class ends. And, uh, you know, I do my, uh, usual... Uh, gentleman like go ahead and walk her to her car <laughs> and you know sometimes one of the great ways to get into a girl's heart is to make her feel pity for you I, I'm, I've been starting to pick up on that I and mean, one of my friends have been telling me that I make them feel pity for you so in this sense uh, she's doing pity, pity for me because she feels bad that I want to walk her to her car you know so I walk her to her car which is totally a long walk back but, uh, you know, we start talking about, you know, she had a job, which she did in free time. Uh, you know, uh, apparently she likes Smash. You know, it's one of her favorite video games. So, oh, I hope she has a 3DS because I want to kick her butt in some Smash. <laughs> Can't wait this Friday. Woo! That demo. That demo is getting kind of boring. But I wonder if she played the demo. I should probably, I mean, on Thursday I'm going to bring my 3DS. And I'm going to bring the demo. And I'm going to see if she play, plays it. You know, because, yeah. I was wondering to get attention. Anyway, of course, um, a take home test. She hasn't even started on it. That girl has not even started on it. So, you know, I, of course, me being the nice gentleman I am and I like to spend time with her and get to know her better, I get offered to go ahead and help her. So she's like, oh, uh, if it's, if it's okay, uh, she'll, she'll call me and she'll ask if she, if I can, um, show up like an hour early on Thursday totally fine I don't this Thursday I don't have women's studies not last Thursday so uh, I mark it down on my calendar make sure not to freaking ditch women's studies anymore but you know I kind of feel like what's the point of going to that class you know I got approachable girl who's apparently turned out to be a bitch so why and I got fucking I've got fucking Kirby girl who apparently wants me to be her goddamn best friend but no so yeah you know, and nah mm. I don't know. She's not a big fan of that class. And it's kind of boring. We talk too much. And we don't really learn anything. It's more about expressing your feelings. But what do you expect out of women's studies, right? <sighs> so, yeah. Don't have class. So, you know, I totally don't mind showing up. How I so, I am going to do this. I'm going to be smart. So, instead of parking near the B building to go ahead and walk to the C building to walk to the B building to then instead of just walking from the B building to the B building parking lot and getting my car and driving home instead I would usually now it's, like I said it's only been the second day since I've, um, I've known her and known her you know, uh, you know talk to her uh, you know, got her cell phone number uh, you know interacted with her it's only been two class periods but uh I would walk her to her car, which is like on the other side of campus, and then walk all the way back across campus, back to my car at the B building. Like, instead, since I know that I'm going to make this a theme of, you know, walking with her, how about 
I just park my car over near the area that she parked. So I, now that I freaking just walk her to her car, I can just easily walk over to my car, get in the car, and drive. Cause it's much easier just to drive a longer distance than walk a longer distance. Like, duh, Daniel. But you know, I wasn't sure if I wanted to be committed. So far, I like her. I really do. I like her. You know, she seems down to earth. Out of all the girls who I gave my number to, slash they gave me their numbers, she's the only girl to actually call slash text me. You know, every other girl has been a straight up bitch. Like, I, I don't know why. I do not know why bitches gotta be crazy. Why you gotta be all mean and disrespectful to me? What did I do to you? I just, I can't eat them. <sighs> bitches. I swear to God, bitches sometimes. But Calculus Girl is cool right now. No. Uh, right now, I totally think she's totally out of my league, but no, I'm, there's no harm in trying, right? So, uh, yeah. So, hopefully, she'll go ahead and call and text me and be like, Hey, coming out early? Sure, I can come out early. I'll help you put this test out. I'll bring the demo. We can go ahead and play that. Hopefully, you have a uh, 3DS, and we can go ahead and play that. You know? She actually, <laughs> we were actually talking, and, she, and I told her I was a YouTuber. She's like, oh, what kind of videos do you do? Like... I play. I play games. <laughs> uh, I'm not embarrassed about playing Yu-Gi-Oh, but it's not something. It's not the biggest icebreaker. You know, I'll, I'll, I'll get to it eventually. But for right now, yeah, it's just some things that you know. Playing Yu-Gi-Oh, into anime, into Common Rider, listening to Korean music. There's just some things that I generally don't open up and just and just pour out all over the table and just be like, well, here I am. You, are you interested? Like, nah, 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 nah. Uh, I'll do it eventually, but yeah, she's in the Smash, so that, hey, that, that's, you know, cute girl with titties who's in the Smash, I mean, and, and apparently smart because she's in calculus, so, you know, she has a good head on her shoulders, you know, she has a car, she has a job, so, generally car and job means she has a boyfriend, <laughs> so, uh, if she has a boyfriend, then I am done, I, I cut it GG, but if she doesn't, then I'm gonna go for it. So wish me luck. If you guys have any points or tips or anything like that on how to get girls, because apparently you guys know I suck with women apparently, be sure to go ahead and tell me in the comments section below. I will take any advice because I'm terrible. So try my best. Try my best. So tell me how my plan sounds so far. By the time you see this video, I'll still have one more day to uh, prepare to uh, <laughs> no, this. Um, my only problem right now, I said my biggest problem right now is that I want her to see me as at least a friend. Cause I kind of feel like I'm still in the, oh, calculus classmate, you know. I want her to call and text me more than just simply like, oh, help me with math, you know. I, I want more than that, so I need to step out of that zone. You know, even, even if I need to step into the friend zone for just a split second before moving out, uh, I need to get there first. Cause I, I feel like I'm still an acquaintance to her, so... Uh, you know, and eventually I probably just need to just ask her out on a date. So I'll probably get to that soon, soon before I get put in the friend zone. Like in the next two weeks, I'll probably ask her out on a date. <laughs> you know, fuck it. By then I should know her at least. You know what's up. So wish me luck. But if you guys talk, but you know, what? give me some advice. Tell me like no, 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 wait longer. Or, no, you gotta do it immediately. I cause I'm terrible with women. So you guys probably know much more. You girls. Right? Some of my girl viewers, if you're out there, you much, you probably know much more about women than I do. I'm in freaking women's studies. I don't know shit. So, yeah. All right. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Daily Duels. Apologize for talking a little bit longer, but you know how I am. So thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Um, what tagging with Tiago using Pendulum Cast Dragons? Yeah. Thanks for watching.